Some of you may be considering purchasing winter tyres and have been wrongly advised to actually fit just two winter tyres to the driving axle. I'm here in Sweden where it's actually illegal to do that. I've got two identical cars, they're both front wheel drive and lightweight. This one has a whole set of winter tyres, whereas this one has them just fitted to the front. So let's see how they get on in our comparison tests. I'm currently in the car that is fitted with four winter tyres and the first test that I'm going to do to demonstrate their effectiveness is go around this top corner as fast as I can. That was pretty effortless. The next test that I'm going to do is effectively dodging an animal in the road. So I'm doing a constant speed of 40 kilometers per hour and I'm just steering. I'm not having to do any corrections. The electronic stability program doesn't need to kick in and the car just drives through those obstacles. So the car that we're in today is a lightweight front wheel drive car. And what we've done is we've fitted two summer tires to the rear and two winter tires to the front and we're going to see how it handles. Okay, so I'm having to do a lot of driving corrections, a lot of steering corrections here to get the car to behave. is terrible. If you're driving along the road and you have to change lane or you have to avoid an obstacle in the road such as a deer or something like that and you just need to turn the steering wheel, I didn't even turn it that much and the back end just slid round which for a front wheel drive car you're not really expecting it to do that. So now let's see what happens when you only fit winter tyres to the drive wheels on a rear wheel drive car. This powerful and heavy Mercedes is so hard to control through these bends. First of all it wants to understeer which is unexpected reaction and then it violently swaps to oversteer. It is such a waste of an expensive and powerful rear wheel drive car if it turns into such a handful. There is no enjoyment in driving it in this state. Wow! Why would anybody fit just two winter tyres to the driving axle? It really upsets the handling of the car and actually makes it dangerous. It's not a surprise that it's illegal here in Sweden. So if you want to save some money and only fit two tyres, please don't do that. It is so important you really must fit four winter tyres to make sure that your car is as safe as it possibly can be in the colder months of winter.